This is MATLAB. This is the command window, the workspace window, and the command history window. I click here in the command window, and I key in some basic math. Let's key in 5 plus 5. And I hit enter. Watch what happens. Three things happened. One, I get a variable called ANS, answer, and that is now assigned the value of 10. Command history window shows what I did a moment ago. I keyed in 5 plus 5. That's a history of worker activity. Over here, I have the variable called ANS. I double click on it, and look what I get. There's the value 10. I close the window up. Next, I key in 95 raised to the second power. 95 squared, that should give me 90. That should give me 9025, 9025. I hit enter, and command history shows me that I've got 95 squared, is what I just keyed in. If I go over to ANS and I double click on it, see it's been updated to 1925. Let me close the window. Huh. So the next thing I want to do is key in another mathematical operation. Let's choose 73 times 77. And that should give me 5621. Yes, it does. Answer equals 5621. You see command history window. That's what I just keyed in. I double click on A and S. And it's been updated. It's been updated in my workspace area. And that's basically what I want to show you today. This is George Bull. saying bye-bye.